Hey guys, welcome back. It's episode 14, and we're back in Jidor looking for some wealthy somebody to give us a ride. Right? Isn't that what they said? Every once in a while one of those shady kids from Zozo. Yeah. How about the auction? Maria, the famous opera diva, is absolutely gorgeous. Now today's auction's still over. There's a good thing people kind of these days unless they had no choice. Well, that's us. Now it was by air, of course. You'd need an airship for that. What? Did you think I was going to suggest launching yourself from a catapult? Are you daft? An airship, huh? A green opera singer. Okay. The opera house is way south of here. I'm not gonna bother with any of those. I want... Sorry, I mistook you for someone else. Wow, you could pass from Maria in a heartbeat. Oh dear, we're really in trouble this time. Isn't that the opera singer? Celeste looks like Maria. Okay. Uh, Alright, what about this guy? You're the spitting image of Maria, huh? Haven't heard of her, you say? She's a famous opera singer. Oh, nice, an ether. I guess I didn't go up here the first time. Okay, oop, dropped something. The man must have dropped this. That man is the director of the troupe that performs at the Opera House. Everyone just calls him Empresario. He's been the, in a tizzy ever since that letter arrived. Okay, well, let's grab it and read it. Dearest Maria, I've decided to take you as my wife, so I'll be coming to kidnap you. The Wandering Gambler. Okay. Who's this wandering what's-his-face? Were you born on a farm, son? A gambling vagabond who finds freedom from society's narrow views of morality aboard his airship of the Blackjack. Setzer, huh? Um... Look like a Setsu, does he? Um, God, there's. I'm limited to what I can put in here. That's what it is. Confirm? Yes, this is Vlad. Yes. That would be Vlad, owner of the world's only airship. He looks like a vampire. If we had the airship, we'd have our way into the Empire. Let's set up a meeting with this Vlad. Okay, well if he's gonna kidnap Maria, then I, I'm going to assume we need to go to the Opera House. Yeah? To the Opera House! Not to here. To the Opera House! Uh-oh. Oh yes, we're on auto. Sorry guys. When I walk in places I'm not recording, I put it on auto. And auto crossbow! Nice! Okay, healed everybody up. Lock learned confused, crunk learned slow. Oh, here we go. Okay, <clears throat> ah, it's you again. We read that letter, so Vlad is coming to snatch Maria away. He'll probably appear right at the climax of the first act. He loves to make an entrance. <sighs> Alright, when he shows up, we'll jump out and nab him. Dear me, no. You'll ruin the performance. I'll lose my job. But if you don't do anything? Oh, this is simply horrible. I want the performance to be a success, but I don't want Maria to be abducted. <clears throat> Let him grab her. <laughs> uh -oh. We'll use a decoy. Once he's got her, we'll follow him right back to, the, to his airship. And if all goes well, we should be able to commandeer it. Are you mad? If anything should happen to Maria. But that's what I'm saying, Haas. 
That's why we use a decoy. We can hide Maria someplace safe. Come again? You said Celeste looks like Maria, right? <clears throat> now, just a minute. She can be our Maria. We'll let Vlad kidnap her and lead us to his airship. Brilliant! Cause she's geeking out. Ho, 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 hold on there. I'm a former general, not some opera floozy. Where's my dressing room? Me, me, do re mi fa. Maria! <laughs> That's the spirit. <laughs> I got my own little surprise plan for y'all. Just like Vlad, it'll be tons of fun. It's the fucking squid again. Uh oh. Uh oh. Another letter. Better get to work. We've got to make a star out of you, Celeste. Ah! Isn't anyone gonna read it? Okay. Time for opera stuff. This is one of the... This was critically acclaimed as one of the neatest things in the game. This little opera scene right here. between the East and the West was growing more violent by the day. Draco, a soldier from the West, thinks of his love, Maria. <clears throat> Back at home, So don't worry. Oh! Ran over. I wonder if that means he was defeated in battle. I guess they're gonna opera at you. Good stuff. Bum, 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 bum. <clears throat> Go on, give her some encouragement. Huh? Where's why is everyone singing? I'm gonna go check on things in the dressing room. Oh, I hope this works. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, let's go this way. To the dressing room. Okay, the letter's gone. Let's go talk to Celeste. Oh, ooh, she's pretty. He's bashful. Ooh, have you always been that pretty? Aww. Locke, why did you stand up for me when you did? Because I'm tired of standing by and doing nothing while I lose the girls I like. <laughs> At least he's honest. I'm just re a replacement for her? Ooh. That ribbon looks nice on you. <clears throat> I have to go on stage soon. This next scene's an important one. Maria starts to worry that something's happened to Draco and pours her feelings into song. Shouldn't you check the score one last time? 
Yes. Read the score? Yes. Scene one. Oh my hero. I'm gonna write this down. Oh my hero. My beloved. Shall we still? Okay. Uh. Still. Okay. Though. Promises of real love. Yet sing here in my heart. Okay, cool. I'm darkness. Darkness. Exchange be with him, not you. Okay. Wow, God, were you only here to quiet my fear? You here, quiet fear. Okay. Guide new. Okay, this is where you pick up the flowers, climb the stairs, and toss the flowers from a high speed. Be sure to finish by the end of the interlude. There isn't much time before the start of scene two. Impresario, scene two. Okay. Let's do it. Bam. Here we go. Oh my heart. Okay. Do I walk? I think it controls me. The Western armies were defeated and Maria's castle fell into the hands of the east. Forced to wed the eastern prince, Rolfs, Maria still thinks only of Draco. As she gazes, something, something, I didn't read it fast enough. The next line is, Oh my hero. Okay, yeah. I think it was just the beginning of these, but best to be sure. Yes, yes, sing here in my heart. Uh, and I'm the darkness. Yeah. You're the starlight. Shining bright, yeah, I'm bright from afar, good. Yeah, that's it. Bam. Okay. Okay, and I think that was the last one, and now I just gotta run up the stairs. These are like little mini quests. Okay, now I think she'll do this on her own and she'll walk to the edge, which is to the left. You gotta toss the flowers? Oh, they're gonna dance, okay. Oh, I've gotta interact with this guy. Come on, let's go. I might mess it up. Okay, I come up here. Uh, oh no, did I? Ah, oh, I fucked it up. Damn it. <laughs> Gotta do it fast enough. Oh, you're kidding me? Okay. Okay, let's go. Ah, oh, you're kidding me. I hope we don't have to do this whole thing over again. And watch the first... Okay, good. Alright, sorry about this, guys. 
I went to the wrong ledge. God, could you imagine doing this without like ever knowing what to do? It's just such a pain in the ass. Okay. Nope. I'm not gonna check a damn thing. I'm just going for it. Boom. Here we go. Maybe I can speed this up. Okay. Faster! Sing it faster! Come on. Oh, my hero. Okay, Z Knight, you can't click through this too fast or you'll fucker it up. Come on. Oh, my hero. There you go. Hit it. Jam out, baby. this opportunity to I think they would just play, like, repeat through a bit until she got to the end, instead of just be like, oh, oh, oh it's all ruined. <coughs> um, must mine. This was probably one of the, I don't know, maybe it wasn't the first introduction of a mini quest or something like that. Okay, homeboy's over there. Let's go and make this quick. Dance with me. All right. Come on now, Hosford. All right. Come on. All right, here we go. Let me grab the flowers. There we go. Bam. Got it right. Oh, look, and we had time to spare. Lots of time to spare. It's awesome. Oh, man, I almost fucked that up. I didn't hit anything. Damn. She was gonna throw it on her own, but she won't. She won't. You've gotta hit it. Okay, we got it. Prince Rolls is looking for his dance partner. Yeah. Please leave the past behind. Our kingdom is part of the East now. Dun dun dun. All right, she got it. <laughs> Wonderful, Celeste. There's that letter. I owe you guys one, so I'm gonna jam up your opera.
Ultros. Uh-oh. Better tell the Impresario. One more baddie to deal with. Guess what, guy? Yeah, we got baddies coming. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The Western survivors attack Rawls. Oh, attack. Rawls says, impossible. Attack! Rawls! Nice. One on one. Wait. Oh, there's another. Oh, two on two. Wait. There we go. Draco! What's up, bitch? Okay, they're gonna fight it out, now we've gotta go, but how is he planning to disrupt the opera? With that? Nice. Mwahaha, let's see if Maria can shrug this off. Four tons. Ugh, it's heavier than I thought. It's gonna take me five minutes to push this thing off. Okay, so here comes... We have, we're having a second to lose. Talk to the stage hand in the room up on the right. He'll help you get up there. Leave it to us. So the room on the right. Hey, stage hand. If I sent you, you need to get to the catwalks. Lower the switch on the far right, but don't touch any of the others. Okay, so now we got that done. Boom. Now let's go to the other side. Over here. This is where these speed boots come in really handy. Alright, up here. This side. I almost went this way the first time. Alright, this should be open now. Sweet. Okay. Now we gotta fight these little rats. That's okay. Oh shit. Oh, I just did that. Oh, you guys are casting thunder, huh? Oh, nice. I'm actually gonna fight these. Oh, he's a tough... Oh, okay. We gotta take out the big boss. There we go. Okay, come on. Three minutes. Alright, let's fight this guy. Uh, uh... Attack the middle guy. Um... Hit that. And auto crossbow. Come on, come on. Nice. Okay. Okay, go. Oops, shit, ran into one I didn't need to. Fuck. Him. Auto. There. Good. Toast? Nice. Three minutes left. Oh, nice. Dodge that one. Oh, dodge that one. Nice, huh? Oh, rats! Come on, punk. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You hear everybody in the crowd like, what? Oh, no. This'll never do. With those two flattened, there's no one to win the girl. How can the story possibly continue? <laughs> uh, neither Draco nor Rouse will win Celeste's hand. 
It is I, Locke, the world's premier adventurer who shall take her as my wife. Oh dear, what dreadful acting. Silence, knave! You stand in the presence of octopus royalty. A lowborn low thief like you could never defeat me. I challenge you to a duel. Hmm, might as well make the most of this. Music! No, no music? It's me again. Long time no see. Did you miss me? Alright, uh, drill him in the face, attack him, and pummel him. Raging fist, bust him up. Acid rain, oh shit. Hit him with the drill again. Thwart it again. I feel like such a sucker. Well kids, I hate to ink and run, but I am an octopus. What a punk. <laughs> Hold it right there. And here comes a fourth person. Actually, I guess this would be fifth. My compliments on a most impressive performance. Oh, damn, stripped her down quick. Vlad! I'm a man of my word, impresario. I am taking Maria. Wh what? Unforeseen twist at every turn. Just as we think Maria is to become Locke's new bride, she's dragged off by Vlad instead. What fate lies in store for her now? Be sure to come back and see part two! <laughs> now I know this is claimed to be one of the coolest parts of the game. I don't think it's the best part though. The halfway point of the game. Oh my god, shit gets crazy. Don't worry, I'll give you plenty of give you plenty of attention later. Nice. Nice. One more. Boom. Done. What a performance. You're a great fake actress, Celeste. Enough! But the real show starts now. It's time for Act 2. Where's Vlad? He should be right back. There he is. Wha- What? What are you doing in here? You're not Maria, are you? Nope. Vlad, we need your help. We need to get to Vector. Your ship is the only... <laughs> if you're not Maria, then we have nothing to talk about. Wait! We heard your ship is the finest vessel in the world. And that you were the world's greatest gambler. I'm the King of Figaro. <clears throat> if you help us, you'll be well rewarded. Come with me. Then you'll... Don't misunderstand me. I still haven't said I'd help you. Business has been awfully slow lately, thanks to the Empire. You're not the only one suffering. The Empire has been toppling towns and villages left and right. <clears throat> They're abusing their Magitech power and trying to take over the world. My kingdom was allied with the Empire until recently. Maybe you want to be a slave to the Empire, but I'm but I sure don't. We're at least together in hating the Empire, right? So, please. You know, I think you may have been even cuter than Maria. Huh? Flushing! Alright. If you... If Celeste becomes my wife, I'll help you. Otherwise... What? Are you crazy? Fine. Great! It's settled. But I have some conditions. We flip this coin. If it's head, you'll help us. If it's tails, I'm yours. I really want to say this is a double-sided coin he used to save him. Well, Mr. Gambler? Ha! I like it. I accept. 
Celeste, are you serious? If you marry that guy... Ready? Heads, I win. Now, it's time for you to hold up your end of the bargain. A valuable trinket indeed. I've never seen a double-headed coin before. That coin? Crunk, don't tell me. I'm afraid you've been hustled, Mr. Gambler. But that's part of the game now, isn't it? Ha! How low can you stoop? I love it. Alright, I'll help you. Gambling against the Empire with noth nothing to lose but my life? I haven't felt so excited in years. My life's a chip in your pile. Andy up. Okay. Did we get the rest of the crew? I can't believe this clunky old thing can fly. You sure it'll stay in the air? <laughs> when things fall, they fall. Life's a game of chance. You play your cards and fate plays hers. They'll spot us in the air from miles away if we try to fly this thing into the Empire. We'd better land a safe distance away. That sounds like a good idea. I'll stay on board and keep the ship ready to take off at a moment's notice. Ooh. This is the, the Empire, or the, the continent that the Empire owns completely, and that must be Vector. It's fucking huge. Where did we land? Allbrook. Okay. So I'm gonna call it here, guys. I'm actually gonna save it. There. Ooh. He knows everything. Ooh. Hang on. He's halfway to Thundara. Halfway to float. You don't have one? I thought you had... Yeah, why? What? Huh? Oh. Alright, well that sucks. Probably because she wasn't fighting with the rest of them. Okay, let's... Ooh, okay. Ooh! Tough these guys are. Here we go. Oh no, they're not dead yet. Nice. Oh, the front one's not gone. Ooh. What's the experience? 305. 2 AP. Obtain gill. Okay, guys. Like I said, calling it here. We'll um, we'll play around with uh, where Vector is in the next episode. Later, guys.